Hi, Mr. Unkert here, and I'm recording on how to make an assignment in Google Classroom. Okay, so this is going to show math teachers how we can write equations in a document uh, for an assignment. So I'm going to go on to my computer classroom that I've created for the teachers. And from here, I have some options, stream, classwork, people, grades. Let's go to classwork. And you'll see I've created one assignment already. Let's create another one. Uh, we're just going to create a regular assignment. Um, okay, we could create a rubric. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to do that right now. Um, let's look at the points. Uh, let's make it eight points. Okay. So we can change the points value. Uh, we're going to title this act, this assignment. Let's call it uh, More Factory. Uh, and the instructions are factor the following problems. Um, write your solutions using equation. You can reach equation by clicking on insert and then going to equation. Okay, let's create this and it's gonna give us an option. We're gonna do it in docs. Okay. We're gonna wait till this uh, loads up. Do -do -do -do. Going to do call this more factory. Okay. And then I'll say factor following problems. Uh, could leave a spot for a name above, but when they uh, submit this, it should show you who's submitting it. So I'm just going to say factor the following problems. Start with problem one. So to get an equation, we're going to go up to here and click on insert. And we're going to go down. We have a bunch of options here. Click on equation. Okay. And let's, uh, before I do that, actually, let's make sure you guys can all see that. Let's increase the font size. So you increase the font size by going to here. And you can go down. Let's make it uh, nice and big. Okay. So problem one. Now, when I hit the space, it moves it out. I can move it back by hitting backspace. Okay. So now I'm going to click on new equation and I want to factor the following problems. So uh, we want a quadratic we can factor. And a way we can do that is by um, way we can get a, a superscript the x squared. Um, hit x and then we can hit shift and six just like you do on a Khan Academy assignment. And then we can make that squared. Uh, we can do minus 6x plus 8. So let's say they had to factor that one. Do another one. Okay. There is another way to do that. We can also uh, go up to here and click on this one. And if we hit this one, we'll type in X, hit the right arrow key, and it'll give us a superscript. So then we can do squared. Um, let's do plus 7X plus 10. Okay. We'll factor that one. Let's do another problem. Uh, I'm going to do a new equation, and let's make this one really not factorable. So I'm going to look for some symbols. Uh, I'm going to put pi x squared minus, uh, let's throw some other stuff in here, beta, beta x. We don't know what beta is, but we can uh, we can identify that later. Uh, plus, um, let's put another symbol here. Okay, and hmm, that one's kind of hard to factor. <laughs> Anyways, you get the point. There are a bunch of symbols that you can use in equation uh, for various math problems. Okay, um, you could also, you can also do square roots and cube roots and so forth. So let's, I want to do a square root of x. I could do that. Okay, uh, let's do a new equation. Let's do a cube root of x. So we're going to pick 
not the square root, but we're going to pick the one below n there. Uh, so we'll do cube root of x. We can do that. Um, we can do a whole whole bunch of different things, okay? Um, as we create this assignment, um, let's actually make this into one equation. So let's put uh, let's do a new equation: two square roots of x. Now let's do two cube roots of x minus square root of x uh, plus three. Okay, and then we'll put up here, we'll say, factoring the following problems, and say, if the quadratic is not factorable, uh, please state. Not factorable. Okay, and let me make it that big so we can all see it. So I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to uh, hold down my um, left mouse button and then and highlight it like so. I'm gonna go up here and change the font and I can go down, it, add 11, let's bring it up to 24. Okay, so that's nice and big, you can see it. Okay, so we've got our assignment, all right? Um, and then we can share that assignment with the class. So it should be shared. It's actually, I think it is automatically shared with the class already because we only have one person in the class. Uh, another thing I could do is get the shareable link um, and I could post that in the classroom, but, uh, I'm not going to do that right now. I'm just going to go over here now and I'm going to assign. Okay. So it's assigning. Okay. So now we have that more factoring assignment is assigned. Okay. And, it, uh, and then it'll appear in your stream as well. So Timothy Anker posted a new assignment, more factoring. So that's how you can assign a, a math assignment with equations in it. Um, if you want to do directly through Google Docs, we'll go into uh, assigning with Khan later on. Okay, thanks for watching. Have a great day.